The Spalding's police in Clarendon have launched an investigation into the death of a two-year-old child. The child has been identified as Goshan Duncan of Longbow, district in the parish. It is, worth, it is reported that about 11 a.m. on Monday, Duncan was playing in his yard with another toddler when his grandmother heard a sound and went to investigate. He was found unresponsive. He was taken to hospital where he was pronounced dead. A search party has been called off for a man who went swimming in the Royal Grande River in Portland on Sunday, April 28, with a group of friends. The search was concluded when the body of the 29-year-old Javan Abrams was found by a passerby in the area around 9 a.m. on Tuesday. Reports are that Abrams of a serious garden address in Kingston did not resurface after he dived into the river. Subsequently, a search party was launched and a matter reported to the police. Friends of the deceased carried out searches on Sunday and Monday with the assistance of the Coast Guard. However, they noted that at its time the river was in state in spate due to every downpour. A 27-year-old Mason was slapped with charges of resisting arrest and assaulting a police officer after he allegedly became boisterous and physically assaulted a police officer in an incident on Saturday, April 27. According to reports, police were conducting an operation at the home of Romaine Perry of Burke Road, Old Auburn, St. Catherine. Perry's room was reportedly searched in its premises when four 5.56 cartridges and one 9mm cartridge was found. Perry reportedly became boisterous following the discovery, hitting an officer in his face in an attempt to, prev to prevent the police from arresting him. Perry is also facing possession of ammunition charges. Charges were subsequently laid against him on Sunday, April 29. A court date is being arranged.